Trade has been an essential part of human existence for millennia, but how and what we trade needs serious review, not just because of the negative impacts which contribute to greenhouse gas emissions and nature loss, but because the potential of trade in sustainable goods and much needed technology. The three statements we've heard today strike at very important drivers of the triple planetary crisis. The trade and environmental sustainability structured discussion statement provides a space for WTO members to discuss how trade policy can mitigate and adapt to climate change and reverse biodiversity loss. And with regards to biodiversity, therefore, this means reaching conclusions on the negotiations on fisheries subsidies so that our fish stocks can thrive. The statement on fossil fuel subsidies targets one of the biggest barriers to renewable energy. These subsidies encourage greenhouse gas emissions and wasteful consumption and drive down the price of primary plastics, adding to the plastic pollution crisis. And the statement on plastics encourages the exploration of ways trade can promote the transition to a circular economy for plastics. We need to be clear on the full range of consequences of plastic pollution and act at source to address them all. I welcome the three statements. I encourage every WTO member state to get involved, not just in each individual work stream, but in bringing all of them together because these challenges are intertwined. We can work with partner organizations to enable the business sector to adopt sustainable initiatives in related sectors.